It's one of the best feelings when you're the only people at the park. Are you excited? Don't let's go! Ah! I think Marcus has some explaining to do to me. We just ate at a restaurant on Sewer Plant Road. Doesn't sound like a good place to go eat, does it? it tastes like shit. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It was actually really good. <laughs> the food was good, but Sewer Plant Road. <laughs> That's hilarious. Just got out of church, first time back in person at least. Since Corona. Yeah. Feels great. Something about church, whenever you walk out, you just feel cleansed. We're going to Grandma's, aren't we? Yeah. We should have went and got food first. You want to? Yeah, the only thing I ate was a granola yeah. bar. Your wife is pregnant, Marcus. I'm wearing You're a tight dress. You're pregnant? What? I never <laughs> noticed. I'm wearing a tight dress and Marcus is like, everybody's going to know you're pregnant. It's like really? your, your stomach's big. <laughs> Whose fault's that? <laughs> right there. So we are right now currently at Marcus's granddad's picking up his four-wheeler because Marcus is supposed to fix his four-wheeler. So we got McDonald's chicken nuggets and then we got Burger King chicken nuggets, which I just put the bag in there. And we were trying to debate which chicken nugget is better, Burger King or McDonald's. Maxon says McDonald's, that's his vote. Marcus says McDonald's and then I'm on the fence, honestly. I do think McDonald's chicken nuggets are better, but this batch of chicken nuggets wasn't as good. And I feel like Burger King outdid McDonald's this time. So that's where we stand with the chicken nugget debate. Maxon's McDonald's strong, always. You got the hiccups? <laughs> I was just started recording and he's like, I got the hiccups, ma'am. You okay? Hold your breath for a minute, for a minute. Maybe not a minute, like 10 seconds. It's okay. You want a drink? I'll get you a drink in a second. Success. We got a Capri Sun back there. You can see Marcus and Pap way down yonder in the bandy boochie back there. I'm sorry you haven't recorded much. Running sickness has been taking over my life. He just climbs to the top of the roof and then jumps off the couch. <laughs> so cool. I wish it was as cool as this kid. <laughs> We're home. Marcus is going to go outside and play with his butt cheeks. <laughs> yep. Are you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> What are you doing? Scrolling Facebook. Are you looking up naughty things? Yeah. We nice. have to pull the couch out like this because when we watch TV, we get a big glare in the television screen because the window's open. We had to push it out so Anakin wouldn't open because he opens the curtain and looks outside. We are now at the park. Maxon's about to get down the slide. Whee! Look at his hair. His hair's sticking up. We're literally the only people here at the park. It's one of the best feelings when you're the only people at the park. We have the whole park to ourselves, Max. Whole entire park. We can ride anything. Oh, people just pulled up. But they're older. I don't think they plan on playing at the playground. I mean, YOLO, maybe. That older lady really wants to get down the slide. She's like thinking about it. She's like, yeah, I totally want to go down that metal slide right there. Well, you riding the chicken? It's what Uncle Cody does. Or he just raises them and makes them into chicken nuggets. It's a circle of life. No, don't let's go. No. Ah! <laughs> Play the part, right? Hey, Maxton, where are we going? <laughs> we're going to grab No, we're going to the dentist. We're going to the dentist. Maxi has his first dentist appointment today. And I went ahead and booked it for all of us because uh, my fake tooth needs fixed. Yay. You wanna go to grandma's today? Maybe we'll go to grandma's today. But yeah, so we're just gonna go ahead and throw this in the vlog. Maxon's first dentist appointment. Would you like some bubblegum toothpaste? <laughs> yeah? Thank oh, okay. you. Mm -hmm. Here, Max, smile. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> are you excited? I can't believe it's actually calm. <laughs> it is way later from our dentist appointments. Came home and crashed, took a nap. <laughs> Update on my tooth. They can't fix my tooth until I have this child. I mean, they said they could, but it's they'd rather not, obviously, because I gotta get x-rays and stuff. And that's not good when you're pregnant to get x-rays. Max's teeth looks good. Marcus really wanted ice cream, so we had to bring him all the way down here to get ice cream. Mm -hmm. New ice cream place. He kept bugging me. Oh, begging, I mean, begging, begging, begging. Because I knew it was here. Because <laughs> <laughs> you knew it was here. He was yep. crying tears, grabbed my feet and said, can we please go get some ice cream? That's what he did. Didn't he? Hannah was there to witness it. Got mint. Maxon got birthday cake. Marcus got peanut butter. 
<laughs> it really shafted me. You got Dang. It's you dead. Dead. One's empty. Yeah, you just remember to eat your dessert first. I think Marcus has some explaining to do to me. I mean, if we're in like this thruple relationship, I at least need to meet this other man. I guarantee if we're in a thruple, it's not with another man. Uh, yeah. Maybe Why? Woman. If we get a woman, she has to at least have what I don't have. And but that's all. Yeah, no. <laughs> some big old knockers on it. She don't really have to have a booty. I have a booty. But she has to have some knockers. I want her to have it all. Like, I want her to be the full package. She has to be the full package and I don't have to? Yep. <laughs> this is messed up. It's like, oh, this is my girlfriend. Oh, this is my baby mama. <laughs> the ugly one makes the babies. <laughs> the pretty one just stays pretty. The other one keeps me in practice. <laughs> <laughs> This is horrible. I think most people would get like mad and have a fight over this. I will. We will off camera. <laughs> Don't shut that thing off. What, Max? <laughs> oh, he, he literally had to announce. He always announces when he farts. Thanks, Max. You I wanted to know. You, you do it all the time. It's disgusting. I'll be laying here asleep, ah. and she'll go. Bah. I farted. <laughs> no, I That's don't. Gross. I don't, but I'll start. Then she pulls the cover over her head. I don't understand it. <laughs> That's so nasty. I would not do that. That's a little grody. Smelt it, dealt it. <laughs> it covers over your head. I put it over your head. No. Not my own. Max, did his mommy fart? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> back, back. Nope. Does mommy fart? Nope. Does daddy fart? Nope. Nope. Nobody farts. Does Max did fart? Nope. Thank you for watching. That is all I recorded this weekend. Um, if you're still watching this, thank you, and virtual hugs to you. You're amazing, and I hope you're having the best week of your daggone life. If you're not, I hope you do next week, or I hope your week gets better. I don't even know what I'm saying. But anyways, I love you. Bye.